Hi, and welcome to violaman.com. Today I'm going to show you how to hold a viola. Begin by putting your feet shoulder width apart to have a nice secure uh, stance, a nice balanced secure stance. Then you lift your head up slightly and place the viola over your collarbone so that it's kind of balanced so that the end pin is going towards the center of your neck. You see how I'm just balancing it right now? I'm not really holding it yet, but it's not going to fall anywhere. It's not going, it's not too far forward where I feel I need to feel the need to hold it with my chin and it's not too far back either. It's just balanced. Then I put down my jaw, I place my jaw over the chin rest and try to find a comfort zone. Now I have a comfort zone. And if it's not comfortable, it's possible that you need to find a better chin rest. But you can work on that later. So find the comfort zone if possible. Use your chin or use your jaw. Just fit it in there so it's comfortable. So you have a nice little grip. Don't grip the instrument. If the instrument is in the wrong place, you might feel the need to grip it. But if it's balanced, you shouldn't have to grip it. You should just be able to rest your head and be comfortable. Now, keep the instrument at a slight angle. You notice I don't have it in front of me like this, and I don't have it on the side of me like this. I have a nice, comfortable angle. If you have the instrument too far down, too low like this, you will have a problem reaching the tip. You may have to bend. You might have to curve the bow to get to the tip, right? Well, if you have it a little higher up, the distance is not as far. The, the further down you go, the further you have to stretch this arm to reach the tip, right? So keep it nice and high like this, nice and balanced. And then if you look from a straight angle from the instrument like this, if I'm not looking here and I'm looking down the fingerboard, you see that the arm is nice and straight. It's not this way, so the instrument feels like it's going to fall out from under me. And it's not too far under, so I develop problems in my shoulders. It's nice and comfortably straight under the instrument. Here's what it looks like from behind. Here's what it looks like when I look down the instrument, or look this way, and here's what it looks like from the front. So that's how you hold a viola. Thank you for visiting Viola Man.